Good evening and thanks for joining us on your Friday. I'm Sophie Erber. And I'm Tim Seaman. A high profile murder trial is set to begin here in Siouxland next week. Jason Jones accused of killing four people in Laurel, Nebraska more than two years ago. What to expect in our top story now at six. Jason will not be appearing in the courtroom during that trial. It is expected to take 15 days in a span of three weeks. Back in July, a judge granted Jason the request to not appear. He has burns on 40 to 49 percent of his body, including his back and lower and upper extremities. Jason is charged with four counts of first degree murder, four counts of using a firearm to commit a felony, and two counts of first degree arson. Uh, Jones is charged in connection with the deaths of Dana, Jean, and Janet Twyford as well as Michelle Ebling, along with setting their two homes on fire. Jones pleaded not guilty to the charges. That trial starts on Monday with jury selection. The trial was moved to Dakota County after a judge ruled Jones would not receive a fair trial if held in Cedar County. If he's convicted, Jason Jones faces the possibility of a death penalty. Meanwhile, Jason's wife, Carrie Jones, has a pretrial conference scheduled for November 25th. That will take place at 11 in the morning in the Cedar County District Courtroom. She's charged with one count first degree murder in connection to the death of Jean Twyford, tampering with physical evidence and accessory to a felony. Carrie has pled not guilty.